Hey everybody, it's Mad Cupcake 7. <laughs> channel so today i'm super excited because guess what was in the mail this <clears throat> well technically this wasn't in the mail the box was the brown box <laughs> but i opened it and this was inside so about a week ago i ordered um a slime package from Mandy slimes on Etsy and also like she has an Instagram account which I'll link in the description below so she's had really good reviews so my mom's like make sure they have good reviews so it's finally um came so came um, it's finally arrived and I'm really excited I didn't have my scissors out because I thought there might be like a package to chop but just this I can hear something shaking inside. I am so excited. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please make sure to subscribe. So, um, let's open the package. Okay, so this falls out automatically. Um, invoice, and I think I saw another piece of paper. Yeah. Okay, let me just get this out of the way. So, here we have a note and an invoice so we'll open the note first hi mad cupcake seven thanks for ordering from underwood slimes i th i was made to slimes i ordered from she might have like put the <laughs> if you have any questions comments complaints or feed feel free to contact me i hope you enjoy your products xox underwoods slimes maybe she changed her username because i'm sure it was Maisie slimes and it said Maisie slimes on the packaging and then we have like an invoice again the paper's quite scrumpled up but doesn't matter um this is all plushies i didn't order any plushies maybe she gave me the wrong invoice because like she's not underworld slimes and this is not what i ordered so hopefully that's not in there because that's not what i ordered but um let's just carry on and pretend that never happened so i pull off brown paper and the first thing i see is this little bag which I guess must be extras so inside it is some toothpicks so I can use those to stir slime and stuff oh and this is really cute owl that's that's adorable mm. and this sushimi keyring I think yeah and this little meerkat Thank you so so much for all of these and yeah so there were another couple of things in the package um this must be an extra two contact solution maybe multi-purpose solution i think and there's also this um wa worker skimble dances on water what you by the way, before we like look at the slimes, which hopefully are in there, um, I ordered two slimes, both mediums, and one of them is called chocolate chip, and the other was called I have no idea. Um, so there's two containers. Let's look at this one first. Doesn't look seem to be much slime in there, but okay. So um, this is what's inside. Oh, it's quite stretchy. It doesn't stick. Um, I'm not sure which one this is. Uh, d uh, does this look like chocolate chip to you? So I must. This must be. You guys can see that. I don't think that's chocolate chip. I'm, oh, it was chocolate chip and cookie dough. Then this must be the cookie dough. One. Uh, this is a medium. It's quite small. I kind of expected something bigger, but um, this is pretty cool. It's, it doesn't stick and. Maybe it's not as stretchy as I thought. I can just add some contact solution, I guess, to it. So overall, I'm pretty happy. But just, like, the size was, like, a bit off-putting. Because I thought it would be bigger. But also, the great thing was I didn't have to pay extra for the container. So I have a container now. So thank you for that. And then the other one in here is in a different container this must be the 
um, chocolate chip. Well, it looks very um, glossy. It's more like a butter sign. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Oh, it sticks down. Oof. Just get this all off. There's still like a heap stuck to the container, which I'll get off later. So. I guess this is a uh, chocolate chip, but it kind of looks like the same color. pretty cool um i'm going to place it on this so i can aggressively poke it this doesn't have slime on it by the way i think it's the under so there has it yeah yeah this is much more like pokeable than the cookie dough one, it's pretty fun to play with actually, but it's just like on the smaller size, I kind of expected it to be bigger. But I guess if I combine the two slimes, it'll make a pretty cool slime. Um, Overall, I think the color, I just want to compare the two colors. So there's this one, like I don't know which is which, but to me they kind of look like the same color. Like there doesn't seem to be any difference in color. Maybe this one's a bit lighter, but doesn't seem to be much difference in colour. So I guess if I mix the two together, I can make like this big one. But um, we may do that in a later video. Yeah, so this one's pretty cool actually. Makes a nice sound. So yeah. Um, yeah, pretty happy with that. So I realised I didn't actually aggressively poke the other slime. Which we'll just put on this lid now and see if it pokes. Oh, wrong side of the lid. Oop. So this one pokes too. But this one doesn't poke as well as the other one and it doesn't stick quite as much overall um pretty happy with this slime package i got slime it kind of wasn't the slime i was expecting but i really don't want to be ungrateful here and also thank you to all of the extras like the skimble the sushimi the owl the meerkat the toothpicks and the contact solution and also i can reuse this bag so thank you very much for those slimes